as you build the size of the loop that you want, we want to make sure and get the right distance between our hands, a little bit shorter here. Some people try to adjust their loop for that, but I'd rather see you adjust your coils that way. And then see how I'm holding it down here in the crook of my fingers? And then my thumb and my forefinger are holding pressure on both pieces of the rope. And if you look at that real close, you see that I don't have these two middle fingers around them strands. If you do, then it'll roll. That's what makes your rope figure eight a little bit. That's kind of what's going on a little bit. Keep pressure here and here and pressure between your two fingers right on that slack. Once in a while, you'll hear people say, point your finger, point your finger. And if, if you do that too much, you'll open up and not have any pressure on it and it'll start figure eighting or rolling on you. So if you want to have your finger out, it's okay, but you can also pull it in. As long as there's pressure between thumb and forefinger is the big deal. Okay, and you want to have, <clears throat> your loop needs to be an extension of your hand. When you see my hand pointed down like that, it looks just like that loop, right? The bottom of the loop, top of the loop, top of my hand, bottom of my hand, Wherever my hand goes, that's where I want my loop to go. So as I'm bringing it around, I'm wanting to swing it flat over that right horn. I make my hand flat. So basically, I'm making my hand do what I want my loop to do, okay? So if I want my loop to come in and catch that right horn, I have to make my hand come in in that position so it catches the right horn, okay? So let's see you uh, copy that. There we go, better. Now you're putting more pressure between your thumb and your forefinger. I like that better. Um, but this finger doesn't need to cover the, this okay. slack. It's kind of heavy. Yeah, right there is perfect. Okay. There and there, that's a perfect grip now. Like basically, when it's pointed this way, I want your hand just like that loop. Okay. Top of your hand, bottom of your hand. You, don't, you would never want it like that right there or the other way, you want it looking straight down, following the position of that loop right there. Yeah. See there? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, that should be some really good footage right there. Because a lot of people will forget that and that'll, it, that rope will roll in their hand and next thing you know they can't control their loop. 